Good evening, this is your Psychic LG reporting for the Native Kingdom. I want you to sit back and relax and I'm going to look into my crystal ball. Now I've got my new mic, you'll have to let us know if it sounds a little bit better. Um, so yeah, <laughs> I had a bit trouble um, connecting it because it would have been an Apple Mac. You've got to go behind the settings and I'm thinking, where's the button? <laughs> and you've got to do it behind the scenes. Anyway, so let's see what's going on. Now I've got, I'm going to pull some cards out and I've got my crystal ball and the cards are good for giving off timings. I know in my last world prediction, I had said that everything was going to kick off and that did on Lionsgate and it did on Friday with explosive news what's come out to do with Donald Trump. Um, I've been doing a lot of meditation on it and um, I just think it's ugh, it's just very weird. I want you to comment on the link below what you think guys, you know. Um, it's just with everything what's happening, what's running up to November. So I want to say if anything's going to happen to him before November or what's going to happen, okay? So I'm going to ask Archangel Michael to come in. We're living in very strange times, guys. And there's so much misinformation and opposite information. So I'm going to ask my guides. So I'm just going to ask Archangel Michael. I invoke Archangel Michael. You always say it three times. I invoke Archangel Michael. I invoke Archangel Michael to give us a true answer. And also I asked Jed, my faithful spirit guide, to come in to give us a true answer to what's actually going on at the moment or if anything's going to happen to Trump. Okay, just going to pull five cards out. Excuse me, because I haven't got like the split screen or anything, so I'll show you them in a second. But I'm going to also do my scrying because I very much trust this. Okay, um, I've been doing the scrying from being a very young girl. Okay, so we've got the Upside Down Emperor. The way I see with that is, I mean, you can look at that many different ways. I read the cards both ways. But it's like the empire, isn't it? It's like the Trump empire. It's like wobbling, it's shaking. Um, and it came out upside down. Well, we know that's happening. That's what's happening at the moment. But it's like he's sitting there. Look at that card, guys, right? I've got a few different mixed decks in here. It's like he's sitting there with his stuff. And it's like, I've got something you don't have. And there's more going on. And I, I said that. I said on my Twitch show on Wednesday night, if anybody hasn't seen it, you can check it back. Was it Wednesday night? I'm losing the days, I'm losing the time. But um, anyway, before it all kicked off on Friday, I said that there was something going to come out to do with paperwork to do with nuclear. Well, obviously that's happened. Um, but I, apparently what Trump's been saying or his lawyers that he's been corresponding with them is it since June or before um, what I can't understand is and I mean I come from military background but what I can't understand is maybe it's different laws in America but how is documents secret documents been allowed to be taken out of the White House in the first place it's just very strange isn't it but anyway, um, that's him rocked at the moment. Right, when the Magician card comes out, it's not very good. So, but this could be on both sides. Remember all to do with the timing and stuff like that. So the Magician card is definitely feeling like there's all sorts of um, shenanigans going on and we know there's mistrust on both sides. Let's have a look. So the Two of Swords, the Empress, upside down, Empress, the Two of Swords. I keep seeing that there's a woman to come forward. Watch for a woman coming forward with some explosive news or there could be like a whistleblower or somebody coming out with some big news. And we've got the Seven of Swords. This is gonna drag on a little bit, guys. So going on the timing of the cards, if you take, um, two of swords away from seven of swords that leaves five months so work that out five months five months um see if we we'll count august should we count august august september october november december i'm unsure i'm going to pull some more cards out if anything is going to happen 
to do with trying to take him into court or anything like that before the November because then it looks like it's a political attack with the midterms coming up. So I'm wondering, I'm wondering if something's going to be left till after November, which is going to get very interesting. And I've been saying this for a while, you know, everything's like a movie, everything's like a show, even though it's literally happening. Got the Eight of Wands here. There's so much that they've got on them. It, it's, it's just, it's like Spaghetti Junction. You know what I mean? It's like the I sort of see him in the corner and it's like they're trying to tie him up and the it's like how does he get out of this web? There is protection. We've got the angel cards, and I always say that the truth comes out in the end. Okay. Because my opinion is that either side there's been, you know, dark stuff going on on either side. The angel, I love the temperance. So there's, there's just a lot of information to come out. I'm see, I'm see Nancy Pelosi like making a statement, which is quite laughable, really, because um, when she's saying nobody's above the law, you know what I mean. I'll not go down that path. Um, <clears throat> I think it's a bit of one and a bit of the other. I've always said it's the same penny. Two different sides. Okay. Um, and I just think once you get higher up that ladder, I think it's the same energy. Does that make sense? What I've been feeling for a while is that this is like all a big distraction to something else what's going on behind the scenes. <coughs> Excuse me. Ten of Cups. There's explosive news to come out. And I want to see, I want to take you into Wednesday. Monday, Tuesday is interesting. It's quite sort of um, worrying. And I would say that would be for like the Republican side or even the Democrat side. But Wednesday, there's some more explosive news to come out. I'm getting, I'm going to pull another row out and then I'm going to look into my crystal ball for you. But the next video I'll be doing will be a um, looking glass video and I'll be doing all the different countries. I just wanted to see what's going on, you know, um, and I want you to comment on the link below what you think, guys. Yeah, there's a feminine energy coming out of this. Um, the High Priestess, I've got the Knave of Wands. There's like some innocence to come out here. Or there's somebody coming forward with some, some huge news. Some huge, huge news. But where the, the full card's coming out, they might be able to get them on some things, but not the espionage or anything like that. I'm unsure about that. This could take a few months, guys. This could take a few months. But the strangest thing is that there's a, there's a twist of fate. I've got him there as the King of Wands. There he is. With a red. Okay. There's like a twist of fate to... It's like I, what I'm feeling is like there's this whole sort of like build up, build up, build up. A bit like a boil ready to pop. And then all of a sudden, it's... Oh, something happens. I want you to remember this. Something happens which is going to just change. The whole picture. It's quite big. Let's see what it could be. Keep getting that song. New York, New York. <laughs> um, the one with Frank Sinatra. That New York one. Right, we've got the Queen of Pentacles here. That's like a Republican woman. Um... She's going to have a lot to see, and I'm going into the end of the year. And to see all these different people lined up to do with the January the 6th hearings, to do with more investigations. And I've said this for a while, that there's going to be all cases brought out. And whatever's coming out, it's like bigger than Watergate, but it's like it's bringing out all cases from the past. 
it's not good for him guys it's not good but time's very fluid what I want to say is that it looks to me that it's both sides both sides it's like a, it's like a movie it's like a game it's like the media is playing all of this you know what I mean and it's all this hype up but it sort of looks very suspicious you know like it's it's like sort of planned to taint him do you know what I mean taint him um for this this election coming up but even though I'm getting that the, the, the information what's coming out is absolutely explosive, explosive. But I'm unsure there's a twist of fate because I'll see what will happen if you like go down that path one, that one or that one. But there's a huge twist of fate to come out with this. And how I've talked about in my other videos, my um, looking glass videos, you can check them out. They're in the listings how I've talked about time insertions and some things are fated and some things aren't. But there's a lot of swords heading his way. Well, she's sort of in that now, isn't he? I believe this is gonna drag on a bit. Let me have a little look. Okay, she's been in the garden this morning, so I'm just having a little check to see what's going on with her. I think there's a lot of worries still to do with weather conditions the bulls trying to show is so i keep getting the sea i keep getting problems with sea earthquake two two or th right there's two or three there's two earthquakes or two volcanoes and an earthquake okay i'm very drunk to japan i want to send healing and blessings out there I see a woman on screen and I'm looking into the USA to deal with all these investigations and she's going to be, I don't know if this is going to be a televised court case or this is going to be something that's going to be on television, but it's, it's like she's coming out with a lot of information and it's definitely connected with Trump. So you need to watch for this. So this is not just to do with Liz Cheney, this is to do with somebody saying something or allegations or saying something. Sunday, big news, Sunday. I want you to remember that. Now that doesn't mean it's this Sunday, it could be any Sunday. Um, by the way, I'm recording this on the Saturday afternoon. Um, let me have a look. It's so deep, guys. It's like a whirling cobweb. It's a whirling cobweb. There's something to come out with banks. And I did say in my last word prediction, again, I don't know if it was on here or if it was on Twitch. You'd have to check it out. Um, I was getting Arabs running through the desert and I was getting deals being made. And I, I said something about nuclear. Well, that's sort of fallen into place now. So deals being made. Um, but I was getting Jared Kushner. And there's a connection of there's something to come out to do with Trump. And I don't know if this has to do with nuclear or... Um, security or something things aren't what they seem things weren't tied up properly where there was paperwork things weren't tied up properly and I'm getting the 13th and the 9th and I want you to remember that now I don't know if that's the 13th of September or the 13th of the month or the 9th of the month I want you to remember that Next Wednesday is huge. I wouldn't be surprised if they try and arrest him or they try to pull him in for questioning. And there will be a televised um, sort of court case that's on a timeline. But it all depends. And I've said this before, this all depends on the woman in the red dress. And I want you to remember time insertions where there could be twists of fate, which can change timelines. And I'm getting that really, really strong. October, November. 
there's going to be a twist of fate to take him out of the situation. But I don't know if it's this year or next year. Okay. I just think that we just need to keep ourselves grounded. Keep ourselves feet firmly on the ground. They've planned this. They've known this for a while. I think there is some truth in that they've needed. There's definitely some truth that they've needed documents. But there's more to it. Do you know what I mean? There's, it's like it's so convenient, the timing and all of that type of thing. Um, but it doesn't look very good for him. I just think there's just so much to come out. And I want you to remember the letter M with big news, scandals. Um, could be Matt Gates. M. And I keep getting Rudy Giuliani and Roger Stone is going to be brought in and invest. There's going to be something to do with Roger Stone as well. This is massive. This is huge. At the end, what's coming up over the next couple of weeks? There's something about timing and everyone's going to be discussing this on World News. And it's something about timing. Um should he have done it this or should they have done it that there's going to be some information to come out with timing and I want you to remember that and it's very very important so I want you to stay, stay blessed stay safe and um, it'll be alright it really will be alright I'm just going to take you through it week by week um, and we just have to hold on to our hats guys I'm just going to see if I can pull one more card out for you I keep getting that song by Neil Diamond. We're going to America. I'm getting that. Our country. Today, sweet land of liberty. It will sort out. It's like something's happened. They can do him. They can do things to many different people. And they have all these informations. But it's only done when it's convenient. But. It all depends on the timing. I keep getting timing today. But there he is again. That's another sort of picture of him kind of swords. He's got the red and he's on the horse. Look how he's marching through. He's a warrior. He's Marmite. You either love him or you hate him. I don't personally think he's the the saviour of America, like a lot of, you know, certain Republicans think. But be it if you love him or you hate him, he's, he's had to come in to change things. But we've got the magician and there's so much lies to come out. But you see, sometimes these lies doesn't always mean it's bad lies, but things can get twisted. But the Seven of Swords, I would say it's um, it's like chess. It's like victory. And we just need to watch this all slowly unfold. He's going to change the Republican Party. America's going to change. But I also don't feel Biden's the future either. It's the younger generation. One more card. I think that we're gonna we're in for some more explosive news to come out, and it's you know it's gonna get more heated by the end of October and by September. It's just huge. It's absolutely huge. Give us one more card. Oh dear me! Let's pick these up. I think that's DeSantis. That's a woman on the, the den side. It looks a bit green, but she's got a blue dress. That's a new lady to come forward. That's DeSantis. But there's also a woman here. Could be connected with DeSantis. Drop me other two cords. 
is a very feminine energy a very feminine energy but I get a very strong feeling with that Pete guy as well I think he's gonna start to step up the mark on the democratic side but there's a feminine energy coming in to the United States of America so watch for a female possibly to rise within the Democrat party but I just think we just need to hold the line stand strong and um, it will all come out but just watch for explosive news watch for explosive news definitely by Wednesday and I'll leave you there with a lot of love from spirit Take care, God bless, wherever you all are around the world. This is your host, Psychic LG, signing out. Bye now. Where am I? I think I'm stuck on end screen. Guys, I need to stop doing this asshole travelling. I keep getting stuck in the cloud. But anyway, I'm stuck in my end screen. So don't forget, subscribe to my channel and press the bell for new updates. The fairies, you know. We're always getting up to mischief. See you all soon. Bye now.